Right, that looks like a record. Hello folks, I'm back again with a, another how-to guide. This one left me a bit perplexed. Uh, not having the app, I couldn't really test it. A little bit of back and forth on Facebook. I found the app, decided I'll install it, that way I can proper test it. So, loop a zoom, or loop a magnifier, does this. And as you've just seen, I've got it working. <gasps> how did I do it? Well, here's how I done it. First of all, we need auto hotkey and a script resembling this. Once you've got the script, you I've done it using a multi-action switch. Hang on, I'll fall for this every freaking time I do one of these videos. Hang on, turn it over here so you can see it. So I used a multi-action switch, so you can see we've got red mag off, then we've got green mag on. If you just used a multi-action, you would either need two buttons, an on and or off, or one button with no way of toggling the state of the button. So once you've got your script, which fires when F24 is pressed, come into Stream Deck, set your multi-action, drag that over, drop in two hotkeys. To assign the F24 key, You select it from the F keys. You can use all sorts of other modifiers uh, to suit yourself. And it's as simple as that. So, hang on, back up, back up. So, this side of the button, as you can see, is initially the off state. So, for what do you want to happen? when you move to the on state, dropping your two F4 keys. So what do you want to happen when you move back to the off state? Drag in two hot keys, set them to F24. So now, boom, we're on. Boom, we're off. Hope that helps. Bye for now.